On October 30, 2024, the Brazilian Ministry of Defense announced that the S-42 submarine Tonelero successfully completed its first static immersion test near Itacurico Island, Rio de Janeiro. This key milestone for the Brazilian Navy marks an important step in the submarine's operational development and enhances Brazil's submarine development program, ProSub. This program, established in partnership with France, aims to bolster Brazil's naval strength and foster advancements in defense technology through comprehensive technology transfers. The static immersion test, conducted without propulsion, involved carefully filling the submarine's ballast tanks to fully submerge the vessel. Engineers adjusted weights along the vessel to evaluate its stability at various angles, collecting critical data on longitudinal and transverse stability. The procedure verified water levels in internal compensation and trim tanks, providing an accurate calculation of the submarine's displacement under submerged conditions. This data is essential for confirming Tonelero, S stability and helps ensure the vessel is ready for future submerged operations. Commander Eduardo Tavares Santos, captain of Tonelero, praised his crew's meticulous preparation through simulator training, which contributed to the test's smooth execution. Commander Santos indicated that the crew's simulator experience was invaluable in navigating real-time challenges during the immersion test. Following the static immersion test, Tonelero will proceed through several additional trials, each designed to further validate the submarine's operational readiness. Upcoming stages include surface tests slated for completion by the end of the year, followed by dynamic immersion trials. One of the more complex tests will involve recharging Tonelero S batteries while submerged, using a snorkel to intake air without surfacing. The crew will also conduct a deep dive immersion to rigorously test the submarine's structural hull integrity. Engineers will carry out another static immersion after additional systems are installed and commissioned, allowing for a final assessment of Tonelero S weight distribution. The S-42 Tonelero is a part of Brazil's Scorpion-class submarines, a French design modified to meet the Brazilian Navy's unique operational demands. At over 71 meters in length and with a submerged displacement of 1,870 tons, Tonelero is larger than its original model, showcasing Brazil's adaptation of advanced submarine capabilities. Launched in March 2024 at the Itaguai Naval Complex, Tonelero is the third diesel-electric submarine built in Brazil under ProSub. Two other Scorpion-class submarines, Riachuelo, S-40, and Humeita, S-41, are already active in the Brazilian fleet. An additional submarine, initially named Angostura, S-43, and recently renamed Almirante Caram in honor of a former Navy minister, is also scheduled for completion and delivery. ProSub's ambitious goals extend to the development of Brazil's first conventionally armed nuclear submarine, Alvaro Alberto, which is currently under construction. The completion of Tonelero S static immersion test not only marks a technical achievement, but also underscores Brazil's commitment to strengthening its maritime defense. With advanced submarine capabilities, the Brazilian Navy is better positioned to secure its vast coastline and protect vital interests in the Atlantic. As Tonelero progresses through its rigorous testing phases, it serves as a testament to Brazil's growing self-reliance and strategic depth in defense technology.